And we turn now to our weekly segment, Tick Talk, where we interview some of our favorite TikTokers and do a bit of a deeper dive into their content. Joining me now, the very funny, the very sweet Kat Stickler. Kat, thanks so much for being here. Hi, thanks for having me. Now, by latest count, Kat, you're up to seven, eight million followers here, so plenty of people already know who you are. But for the people who don't, what can they find on your TikTok account? Authentic, honest content and impersonations, too. I'm glad you brought up impersonations. Uh, yes. Can you walk us through that and and how, on top of just, I know you're just acting like your mother, but it's also kind of highlighting your culture, too, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I've had, like, my whole lifetime to train for that role. <laughs> Everything <laughs> is just, I just think about it, and I'm like, oh, yeah, there's, like, unlimited content I can come up with with my mom. How does she feel about it? Oh, she loves it. She thinks, I think she thinks I'm the funniest person ever. So that makes me feel really good. Wow. My mom's my number one fan, for sure. I don't, uh, I'm not calling you out, Kat, because you look, you, you look very sharp for your interview. We noticed your hair is wet, and I heard before this, it was because your baby spit up on you. It was, yeah, she spit up, and then she got everything wet in the tub, and I was, like, trying to wash it off, and then I, my hair got wet from the tub, and I was like, just screw it. I'm going to shower because I need it. But I am it a mom, too, so... It this still works. Reality. It still works, yeah. and that's why we bring it up, because you are very open about your personal life on social media. What is, I mean, everyone on social media is sharing about themselves, but it's different when it's your job. How do you find that balance, kind of being authentic and sharing? Um, I just think about if I would like my daughter to see what I'm putting up, like, when she's my age, like, be like, oh, that was cool, Mom, or that was funny, or... I just kind of want to make her proud. So whenever I like think about it, that's usually what's always in the back of my mind. That helps. Do, do you get people be, being so open and sharing? I mean, you talk about the fact that uh, you're a single mother. You were very open about your divorce, which uh, took a lot of strength to share. Do you get people reaching out to you maybe for advice or talking about their own lives because they're seeing what's going on in yours? Oh, yeah. Sometimes I don't feel... Like, I'm certified to give that advice because I'm still learning, but I try to help where I can. And I think people seeing the journey helps make it, like, you can do it. Like, I show when I cry, and I show when I laugh, and I show when it's hard, and I show when I'm lonely. And I feel like that makes it relatable, but I also show the rise up, which is probably the best part, which is kind of currently happening, so that's fun. You've said that this was your dream job. This is what you always wanted to do. You, you say you get ideas from your mother and endless content ideas. Is just living your life, are you constantly saying, that's something to put on, that's something to put on? Or is it sit down and work? Sometimes it's hard to feel inspired or creative, but I do think about how I can make content every single second. Because it's like how I, it's how I make money. So it's my job, but it's not a nine to five. Like, I feel like it never turns off. It's like, I'll be with my mom and she'll say something funny and I'll write it in my notes. I'm like, that was <laughs> really good. Or MK will do something funny. It'll remind me of a video I could make of her and I'll write it down. So it's kind of 24 seven, which That's is cool. I don't mind. That's amazing. Well, Kat, we really appreciate your time. Thanks so much for joining us. And hopefully some people, even though there are already millions following you, we're hoping people watch this and they follow you too. Thanks, Trevor. Thanks for having me, you guys. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.